Yeah. Heck, man. Freaking pickers ain't got nothing on me, man. Oh, my fellow resellers, thrifties, junkers. There's a whole bunch of junkies, man. I'm out here in my, my junk pile, little salvage yard area. Been up here looking for a couple of things. Um, hadn't done a video for a few days, man. If you watch our other channel, we've been doing some fishing, and then I had a hard time with the the rock rock hounding, and we were out looking for uh, crystals, and gemstones, and stuff. And that, um, you know, because we sell a lot of that kind of stuff too. So that was right on the border of putting it on Idaho hillbilly or putting it on mountain junkers. And until the count gets up on this channel, so man, please subscribe while you're here. But, uh, we'll be doing a lot of that, you know, because we're going to hit some ghost towns, some abandoned buildings, we're going to go dig for bottles, lots of big plans. The only thing that may interfere with the, uh, let's get out of this pile. The only thing that may interfere, there you go, it's a little bit better, but, uh, on check out, man, Mountain Junkers. You should get one of these t-shirts with the little logo here, and then we have a couple more. Of course, that battery's blinking, so. All right, so now maybe we can get back to the conversation. Maybe one thing gets another, especially these days. Anyways, check out the seed. I don't know how well you can see it, man, but this has got the little logo, the little Mountain Junkers logo, and then we have the other ones that should be coming any time, man, that uh, is the bigger logo, Mountain Junkers. Pretty excited about these. These were this one, man, with just a little logo. Great for working. Gee, man, Christmas, dude. Never claimed to be no camera guy, but uh, anyway, back to what I was trying to talk about over there is everything that's going on. Right before I came out here, step back inside. Miss Kitty was telling me that we just got an email from uh, eBay, and if you're a seller, uh. On eBay, you probably got the same email man, about the um, coronavirus and stuff. And they're going to, you know, if it affects the mail or it affects uh, anything to do with us sellers on eBay, then they're going to work with us and it's not going to affect our store and stuff. Man, it's scary times, dude. And, you know, a lot of uh, folks and family and stuff that I talk to, they're like, oh, don't worry. It's just another, man, political thing, dude. Uh I don't think so, man. This is uh, this is pretty crazy, man. I haven't my 51 years ain't experienced it. You know, we went through the, um, you know, all the mad cow disease and all that different stuff that, but it never really made it, you know, onto our shores or in the states like this has. And I mean, it's just it's it's crazy times. So, man, I just wanted to touch on what to do as far as uh, what our plan, you know. What you can't, it's hard to make a plan when you really don't know what's going to happen. But like I was telling Miss Kitty, is that's, man, being a junker, man, that's a good thing because I will lock down my, uh, you know, my crick bottom, you know, my salvage yard, all this, man, I will lock this thing down so tight, you know, other than trying to get packages sent out and stuff. But that's where it's nice to have a stockpile of, you know, junk and stuff to sell and to be able to make, you know, because I can go out and pound knives. That's one thing that I know that, you know, I can always make money on if if I can ship them. I mean, if they shut down the, you know, who knows what's going to happen. You know, I mean, it, it it's crazy. So it's pretty interesting stuff, man. I've been paying quite a bit of attention to it. I try, you know, you try not to get too stressed. There ain't much you can do about it, man. You just got to take it, take it with as it comes. So, but I just wanted to get out here and touch on here. And like I said, the uh, the rock things, I have a hard time um, juggling which one. Uh, you know which channel I should put that on we are going to clean up some and there's a few pieces that I will probably put up for sale and stuff so we'll probably show some of those on here sales have been pretty steady I don't know how yours has been it's not been um, you know an extreme you know selling a few things every day man knock on wood you know, keep you keep you all float and everything like that but uh, I think people there I think there's a lot of people worried about the, what's gonna happen which, you know, in our building, man, at least I ain't getting my stuff from China and stuff. So that, that part's pretty cool. But I hadn't really thought about them shutting down the, you know, the postal service and all that kind of stuff. 
Now that aside, which, you know, we all got to pay attention to what's going on with that. So check your email if you didn't get that email. It should be in there if you're a seller on eBay. And then uh, got some other things we're working on. You know, I've had a few people, a good handful of people ask me what happened to the uh, mountainjunkers.com. And it just started going in a direction that I didn't want it to go go in. And things were just not um, flowing right. So I just... We sh shut it down, man. I just didn't, you know, I wasn't going to put my name on it because that's not, it wasn't doing what I wanted to do. Nothing against anybody or anything like that, man. And it was, I think it would have been, could have been something, but it wasn't. But anyway, so uh, we got some other stuff in the works that we'll be able to uh, do how I want to do them. Um, don't, and the other, one of the other things that had uh, actually, as we were going and talking about it, you know, on the thing that, is you've running a site, you know, with you guys selling on there and stuff too. Um, you know, you'd have to do your own because you got man, the taxes, you know, and the government, man, they're on that right now, you know, and eBay takes care of all that for you, Etsy takes care of all that for you. So, us running that site, we wouldn't have been taking care of that, you know, that would have been everybody else's own responsibility. So, you got to kind of weigh that to see what how that'd work out. But what we're working on right now is we'll see, you know, I'm not going to talk too much about it. I ain't going to give nothing away, man. But we got some things in the works, so hopefully we'll get those rolling. Like I said, man, right now it's all kind of, uh, you know, see what happens with this coronavirus, man. Because it's just, it's out my back door, man. These, you can't see the mountains, but man, it ain't too many mountain ranges over where all this is going on. So it's a little... You know, they could shut this this country down. So then I'll be back out just trading my junk, man. Back, back we'll take a step back 30 years like I used to do it. That's all I wanted to get, man. Just let everybody know we're still out here doing our thing. Um, I hope everybody's well out there, man, and be careful. And, you know, if you're out there, uh, well, keep your eye on the skyline. Keep your nose to the wind. And if you're out there treasure hunting, hope you find some color in the bottom of your pan. See ya.